So in this experiment, we're going to take some copper powder and we're going to react it in a chemical reaction that is referred to as a combustion reaction with some oxygen in the air. In order to carry out this practical, you're going to need a specific set of equipment and there is a specialized way in which the equipment must be set up. First of all, you need a heat proof mat. You need your Bunsen burner securely connected to your gas tap and the hose is safely in on the bench and not hanging over the edge. You need a tripod stand and you need a pipe clay triangle on which you are going to place the crucible with some copper powder and a lid. You will also need for this experiment a stopwatch, a tongs, and a gas lighter for lighting the Bunsen burner. However, uh, you also need to make sure that initially on the heat proof mat, the setup with the tripod, clay triangle and crucible is kept to one side and the Bunsen burner is slightly towards the ed edge of the heat proof mat. Before you light the Bunsen burner, we need to practice using the tongs because throughout the period of this experiment, you are going to have to very carefully, like so, grasping with the tongs, the handle of the lid, lift the lid carefully up and down, periodically over the course of the experiment, so that you let oxygen from the air in to react with the copper. But you must be careful that when you lift it up, you only lift it up about two to three centimeters above the crucible so that we do not lose any of our chemical product that is being produced in this reaction. Once you have practiced that and you feel confident with the use of the tongs, you are then going to light the Bunsen burner. You can light the Bunsen burner, make sure that it's lit first with the safety flame. And once it's been lit with the safety flame, again you're working with your partner so you can give your partner the stopwatch. You then change, this experiment must be conducted with the blue hottest flame, the roaring flame. So therefore you open the air hole fully and once the air hole has been opened fully, you then insert the Bunsen burner underneath the crucible and you start your stopwatch and you time the reaction and allow it to proceed for three minutes.